My name is Salome Paul and I'm here to tell you what AVID means to me. Um, AVID has helped me with my study skills, build leadership, and it's also helped me with goal setting and applying as well as getting scholarships for college. Well before AVID, um, I honestly didn't even realize what college was, what college meant. I came from a family that, like, no, none of my parents went to school so I didn't I didn't even understand the college process, but through AVID, I learned about the college process. I learned how to take better notes and also take initiative when I'm confused in a class or when I don't understand a certain subject. At the beginning of the school year, I remember I was I was not doing very good in pre-calculus. I failed my first test, and instead of instead of doing what most kids do, which is complain about it, blame the teacher and just let the grade slip. I went in every single day. I I had him help me with the with the notes and with all of the problems and I also asked questions in tutorials to help me better understand the subject. I want to go into health sciences so that I can help people and work um, first work locally and then I want to go um, back to work to Uganda where I'm from and help the people there because I know they lack a lot of medical resources over there. Hi, I'm Jack Ray and I'd like to tell you what AVID means to me. AVID for me isn't so much a program. AVID is a, a, a way of life on how to get through high school and how to get through um, your regular life and how to get through college and how to get to your career. AVID is not a, you know, a study hall. It's basically where you learn all the core values necessary to get by in school, especially with the new Common Core standards being instituted in the Boise School District, as well as how to how to commit to things and how to get far through interviews and, and different ways of, of being with your bosses outside of school. The avid the avid skills that you make they're the basic ones like note taking, how to take advantage of programs that are there to help you, how to take advantage of tutors and teachers, and how to basically listen in class, how to be able to connect in class. There's also skills that are a lot more uh, subliminal, like. Uh, skills like being able to talk in front of people, being able to get involved outside in extracurricular activities, interview skills, we've worked a lot on interviewing in the years past, and even stuff as simple as filling out a tax form. We, 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 we learn about that and how to do that, so it prepares us for the next level that we're going to take after high school. I get a college, I want to go into law enforcement, so a lot, a lot of the times I'll say, people will tell me, you know, you want to work so hard to be a street cop, well, I mean, yes, I'm working hard so I can be a street cop, but I also, you know, I want to be able to rise in the ranks, you know, maybe maybe a higher higher level than just a street cop someday. Hey, I'm Pam Atkins, and I'm the AVID 12 teacher at Bora High School, and I'd like to tell you what AVID means to me. Uh, I think the program itself has made a, a huge impact on the way we do things here at Bora, uh, for one, uh, one of our most influential things has been to have all the junior AVID students apply first to colleges. And it amazed us here that that started uh, kids talking about, now wait a minute, you're a junior and you already applied to BSU and ISU and U of I? Oh yes, you know, and so they've been able to become models for every student here. Hi, I'm Sydney Bell. I'd like to tell you what AVID means to me. Okay, uh, so I've been an AVID since seventh grade, and right now I'm in ninth grade at the same school, South Junior High. Um, so when I first got into AVID, I didn't really know what it was. I didn't know like what it was gonna do. I was kind of like wary about it. I just knew that I was interviewed to be an AVID and that I was gonna be an AVID with other people who were interviewed as well. So at first, in the beginning, AVID really helped me organize because I wasn't really good at organization and keeping myself together as far as my schoolwork and keeping my schoolwork apart from my like family life. Um, and AVID actually, I love to read, and AVID really encouraged my like my love to read. I didn't picture myself going to college. I know I knew I was smart enough, but no one else in my family, like no one in my family, has ever been to college. So I would be the first one to ever go to college. So because no one in my family had gone to college, I didn't really see myself going to college either. What about now with Abbott? I'm definitely going to college. <laughs> yeah, definitely. 
I'm Chance Eaton and I like to tell you what Avid has done for me. Um, the most thing that it's helped me with is like organizational skills because when I was in elementary school I wasn't very organized. I had a habit of losing projects especially that we had to take home. Like I'd take it home and I'd forget it or I'd misplace it. And with Avid um, we ended up getting like graded on our binders. So like if we didn't have stuff in the right spot or if our homework wasn't clipped into the right section we would get graded down so because of the grades and I wanted to get a good grade I really started paying attention to like where I was putting my stuff and then I ended up um, keeping it safer like in a safer spot so I wasn't losing it and I was turning it in so all of my grades were going up just because of that. I think that AVID is a very structured program that helps the kids that can't think or don't think they're good enough. We get behind them and we stand them up and say yes you are. You need to do this, you can do this, we're right there to help you, tell us what we can do. And once the kids buy in and once they know that we're there for them, they just skyrocket.